All right, everybody, welcome back. My name is Gillis the Kid, and I have another gameplay walkthrough here for you. This time, we're going to be playing Legend of Lagaya. This game originally came out on the Sony PlayStation back in 1998. It is one of the greatest games, in my opinion, of all time. And it is highly underrated. I'm going to have a couple of videos. Nothing too crazy. But um, I'm going to have a couple of videos to where I can condense it down. And uh, we're going to start a new game. Here we go. Alright, so here we go. This is the main protagonist of the game, Vaughn. And I'm just going to keep the same name. He's got blue hair.
and you start off in this little town called Realm Elm. Now I'm going to tell you uh, exactly what's going on so you don't have to read everything. Alright, and at the top corner, at the top left corner, you're going to see that you're level 1. You have uh, hit points and your uh, magic points. And this is the Genesis tree. We'll talk more about that later. Now that's May. Um, she's not your girlfriend yet, but um, she does kind of have a crush on you. And you're in this small town because the mist is outside. This is a save stone, so this is where you save at. We'll come back to that in a minute. There's kids out playing. I think I'm supposed to go hunting too. Are you in love with my brother? <laughs> now that's your sister. Her name is Nini. Your sister basically says whatever's on her mind. Now she's measuring me to make my hunter clothes because you're supposed to become a hunter and you have to go out into the mist and uh, bring back food for the village. Yeah, that's her father's name, Juno. Now for those of for those of you who want to know more about the story, um the mist came to the t uh the mist came to the land and it turned the Rasharu, which are the creatures that give you powers, evil. So now everyone, they're sort of like uh, in quarantine, basically. This is Tatsu. Oh yeah, we can practice. And he gives you a healing leaf. <laughs> Now you definitely want to learn how to fight, so you gotta pay attention. This is one of the coolest things about the game because it's different from other RPGs. So you can do auto or command. 
I guess we'll just... Yeah, I guess we'll do auto for now. It plays a lot like Tekken. Then we're gonna select the item. They're gonna show you how to heal yourself. Now, spirit is when you basically save up your power, and then your next turn you can you can dish out even more powerful attacks. And we're going to talk about hyper arts. Let's see, attack, command, and we're going to do. You can do high, low, left, and right. So we're going to do high, low, high. high lo okay. That's enough practice for today. And we're going to learn more arts as we go along. Hunters are back. I love the music in this game. It's absolutely phenomenal. And the story is uh, it's well written too. So her father Juno has died. I think he got injured by some monsters in the mist. So we're going to go home. There's actually a tree over here you don't want to mess with yet because they have bees and we're not powerful enough to defeat them yet. This is the store. Now we have to come back here to get the point card. That's a very important item, but we'll come back. And you're 
you're going to say yes and go to bed. I sense the presence of evil. Now this is Zito. Uh oh. The mist. The mist is in the town now. Now this enemy, we can actually absorb its power, but we have to uh, get to the Genesis tree first. Let me do some commands real quick. Let's try another one. This is a good way to learn all your moves. Let's try up, down, left. Oh. Once you learn a move, uh, you can always view that move too. Let's see, command. If you hit triangle, you can look at all the, like all the moves that you've learned. So let's try another one here. also have to have the the right uh what is that ap let's see what we have
Yeah, they call them art points. AP. Alright, let's get to the Genesis tree here. And the reason the mist doesn't come near the Genesis tree is because it has the power to repel the mist. Now Meta is a Rasharu, and Rasharus attach themselves to humans and they can give you powers. Now, that is true. If you enter the mist, if you enter the mist with a Rasharu on, you can become, uh, like, infected. And they can take over your body. But I have a Rasharu, so they can't control my mind. What is this, the green slime? I think we have to go to the village elder. Oh yeah, we gotta heal. Oh god, no. We might actually have to run away from this. Let's try and run. No, we can't run, no. Sometimes you can run on your on the next turn. Um, okay. Oh, he ran away. <laughs> and there you can see the Rasharu on his arm now. It'll actually evolve too. You'll see the changes as we go along in the story. Where's the village elder at? I think he's up here. Yeah, we're gonna try and uh, absorb its power now. You don't want the game on auto all the time, but uh, I'm pretty confident in myself. Certain moves will absorb the power, so... Uh, let's see what we got here. Yeah. 
This monster, he's blocking everything. Alright, so let's do... Oh! Oh, I didn't get it. We're gonna learn some new moves pretty soon. Yeah, there's no mist in here. It's a Rasharu. So now everyone is gathering near the Genesis tree. Let's pray. We have to pray now. There you have it. We've activated our first Genesis tree. And it radiates pretty far too. And this is Juno's funeral, along with the two other hunters that got killed. This game is absolutely amazing. They need to remaster this game.
So wait, they don't bury you? Now the Valley of Nauru is actually a place you get to visit, but that's way later on in the game. So the next place we have to go is the Byron Monastery. Look at the Genesis tree. You know what? <laughs> I was supposed to come here and uh, get May when the monsters were attacking, but it doesn't really change the story. But the one thing we want to get uh, is the point card. Let me see if I'm able to get it now. It's locked. Eh, I guess I'll have to come back. And this is the store. You can buy different stuff. You can also sell things, too. Um... I don't really think we need anything right now. And healing leaves, they recover 200 health points. You got antidotes, which cures venom. And then you have the door of light, which we'll get later on, and you can teleport out of dungeons. Oh, I forgot about the clues. <laughs> oh, that's messed up. <laughs> Mind your own business. You'd better come back. Uh, yeah, I'll be back. Let me check out these clothes you got me. So we have items. There's the hunter clothes. And we have magic, which we have none right now. 
Okay, we put the hunter clothes on. And this shows your status. So you got attack, upper defense, lower defense. You got speed, intelligence, and agility. And it'll also show uh, which level and uh, magic powers that you have. These are all our moves that we've learned. We're going to learn some more moves pretty soon. But before we leave this village, I'm going to save it here. And as you can see, uh, I'll show you my other two files here. I actually beat this game about, well, about 20 years ago. And uh, the highest I've got was level 41. And then I have another file which I've got up to level 38 for all three characters. That was a long time ago. I'm going to save it right here. Yeah, I know that. Why is it saying... Oh, okay. Oh, I don't want to save it over that, though. <laughs> Let me go to slot two. Let me see if that works. Alright, whatever. I'm not going to save it over that, but I just wanted to show you. But I'm going to leave the video here. I'm going to have part two coming up pretty soon. I want to thank everybody for watching, and I will catch you on the next one. Peace.